Well, we're not quite finished, but my contractor guys are finished. This is the wall here. Let's see, that's going down to the basement. Okay, so there's the wall with the double oven, so go there. They just have to be hooked up. This is the, I have a cabinet. I have the cooktop and a cabinet, and then the vent hood goes up there. That's going to be pretty. I haven't decided on backsplash yet. I was going to wait until I got the cabinet in, I mean the countertop. And I don't think I'm going to put uppers there. My vent hood is pretty good size. So maybe run some decorative tile just above where the um, switches are. Up here, I've got a stainless plate that's gonna go right there, and then I have new spice bottles that I will put them up magnetically. There's the walkway into the living room that will have a barn door. It's supposed to be on this side, but apparently we can't measure. No one can in anybody. So it's going on the other side. Then, this is my massive wall of cabinets here. The pantries on each end, and then the cabinets on the bottom have three drawers, and then my uppers go to the ceiling and countertop. This will be my coffee station, also where I put my you know, instant pot and things like that when I use them. So there's power in the pantries on each end as well, which is nice. I'm going to put all the electronics in one, and the other one's going to have, like, the Alexa and all the charging station. There's Hans. He is inspecting the backyard. He sits in any window that's open. Then, let's see, right here where Hans is at, I want to put a little, like, a two-seater, um... You know, a little ice cream table, maybe a metal one, black metal one with chair, just to be able to sit in front of the window, have my coffee, watch, you know, talk with my hubby, or have my Bible study, or whatever. Then there's the wall for the sink and stuff. So this is where the refrigerator's going. It's supposed to be delivered next week. Then we have cabinets got the uppers got the kitchen sink going there Ref dishwasher cabinet and then this area is the old where we ate at I'm not sure yet what i'm gonna put here i'm thinking some type of maybe a, i don't know farm style table now between the cabinets i've got eight feet so I haven't decided on what type of island yet. I have extra lower cabinets that I could put on each end and then put like a butcher block or something on them. But I'm not sure yet. So continuing, my laundry room is in here. It's just still a laundry room, but now it's got cabinets. And then this is the family room that's now... A part of the kitchen because there's no big beam. There was a huge beam that ran across here. We took down. That's fun. Our fireplace is going to be painted and we have um, gas logs to go in it. So that'll be fun. Then this is our entertainment area down here. We've got upper stacked up here mounted together and then two lowers here's some of my extra cabinets so from the family room there's my kitchen oh all the kitchen that's pretty neat i'm so excited it's huge so i'm here out to the back door so let's see what else we got i don't know what i'm gonna do in this long wall here it's a long it's like 28 feet about the only solid wall in the house so let's see i have a pantry here i have my 
going into my foyer. This is the part to the barn door. Then let's see, I have my new bathroom here, my sink, and my pretty shower. It's a neat shower. I like it. There's Gabby. Hey, Gabby. Move. Let's see. Of course, we got to put the door back. Then, let's see. That used to be the coat closet. So, I have no lights. That's the only downside to all this. So, this is my living room. It's ready for new um, receptacles and light switches. I have to get those up. But the trim's done on the windows. Still need to get rid of this monstrous entertainment cabinet, but I have more extra lower cabinets there. So, then you can go in the kitchen. This is our electronic center with all the stuff. That's where the barn door will be. We'll run all the way across there. And we're back in the kitchen. It's so nice. I'm so excited. Can't wait. My countertops will be here either tomorrow or Monday. And then I'm still waiting on the electrician to come, work his magic, getting everything hooked up because right now I have like a little hangy light. I mean, it's truly just like hanging from a wire light. That's the only light I have on the back of the house. <laughs> so anyway, that's it. I'm so excited about that wall. Again, I don't know what I'm going to do as a backsplash, but there's only 18 inches tall by 9 feet. So, what is that? I don't know. I will put something pretty back there. I'm thinking maybe some color. And then those corner things up there. I have no idea what to put up there. I could put a silk plant or something up there that I can kill. But... Certainly nothing that requires attention and nothing that's going to get too icky. So, same thing here. I don't know what to do about a backsplash yet. So, we'll have to figure that out, but that's fine. I'm done. I'm more than done. I am ready for this to be over. My guys have worked hard. But I think that it was a challenge. I think the job grew to far more than what anybody thought it would. Kind of hard doing the whole level at one time. But for me, I'd rather live through the chaos and get it all done than to do one room and then have to go through it all again and again and again. But anyway, there you go.